in China. A Chinese tycoon believed to have links to China's former security chief Zhu Yanghang has been sentenced to death. A Hubei court found Liu Han and his brother Li Wei guilty of organizing a leading mafia-style crime and murder. The two men were among a group of 36 people charged with similar crimes. Liu Han's sentencing is believed to be part of a wider corruption crackdown linked to Zhu's network. The court verdict stated that, among other things, Liu Han and his group had, in an organized fashion, obtained financial gains via illegal activities. Liu, who is the former head of mining conglomerate Sichuan Hanlong Group, was ranked 148th on Forbes' list of the richest Chinese business people in 2012. Still in China. A Chinese media report says five people involved in the Xinjiang attack that killed 31 people blew themselves up. The attack took place early on Thursday in a marketplace in Ulumog. More than 90 other people were injured as attackers in two vehicles drove into crowds and threw explosives. One of the vehicles then blew up. China called the attack a violent terrorist incident, while the U.S. called it an outrageous act of violence against innocent civilians. UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon added that there was no justification for the killing of civilians. The latest information comes from the state-run Global Times, which said it had got information that five sus suspects who participated in a terrorist attack blew themselves up. The police are investigating whether they had accomplices.